Hello everyone, this is Matt from Real World Review, and today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak an iPhone on iOS 12.4. This will obviously work on iPads and other devices like that, and in the description I'll have all the links to everything I talk about and pretty much every device that this will work on. So what we're going to use right now is an iPhone 6, and this one has been updated to 12.4. I did update it, however I highly recommend just restoring the phone to 12.4 if you don't have any information on it. So what we'll do is we'll plug it into the computer and it'll show up this little message right here. You wanna click continue and then you wanna click trust on the phone itself so then the computer can read it. Now, like I said, you do wanna be on 12.4 so make sure to update to that if you haven't. And once you have, let's continue. Now we wanna download the Undecimus IPA. This one is on 3.5.0. Yours may be a newer one depending on when you download this but right now it's 3.5.0. So once we have that downloaded, we're going to put that onto the desktop, and then we're going to go to cityimpactor.com and download City Impactor for Mac OS. I have Mac OS, so select whichever one you have, if you have Windows, Linux, whatever. Once that's downloaded, open it up, and there should be a button where you have to click open, and then once you open that up, you'll see this little menu right here. It'll say the name of your phone and a long number that's specific to your phone itself. So what we want to do is drag the IPA to that, and then it'll ask for your Apple ID. Don't worry about this too much because supposedly this goes only to Apple servers and that's it. I've been doing a method similar to this for a couple of years and I haven't had any issues, so you should be fine. Now let City Impactor do its thing. And once that's done, we're done with the computer. Now that we're done with the computer, you can unplug the phone and we will do everything else on the phone. So make sure that you're synced to the Wi-Fi, go into your settings, scroll down to general, scroll all the way down to device management, click your email address, click trust, and click trust again. Make sure on this list only uncover is there and that's it. So once that's done, click the home button, go back to uncover, and all you need to do is click jailbreak. Now I'm going to speed this up because I had a lot of issues and I had to try quite a few times and eventually I just gave up and I updated the phone. So now I'm on a fresh install of 12.4 and I'm gonna click jailbreak again. And this is gonna be the first time that it failed. I'm gonna click it again. It's gonna fail again. Click it again. It's gonna fail again. One more time. And it looks like it's doing something. And on the third time, it looked like it worked. So now I'm going to go into Cydia and you do whatever you want. I mean, if you don't believe me, I'm going to update some of these packages, but it is jailbroken now. Now, if your phone dies, all you got to do is reinstall this again, which is easier said than done. It does take quite a few tries to get it going again. For me, it took about three or four tries, but... That's all you gotta do to get it back on, and then you have Cydia again. And if it's past seven days, all you gotta do is reinstall through Cydia Impactor again. But that's all you gotta do. It does take quite a few tries, but definitely don't give up, and I highly recommend reinstalling the operating system first if you can. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. I might not be able to answer all your questions, but all the links in the description might be able to help you out as well. Hopefully you enjoyed this video, subscribe for other videos or review videos as well, and hit that bell button so then YouTube actually reminds you when those videos do come out. Thanks for watching.